Hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's episode, we'll be delving into how easy it's going to be for you to start your own Unity 6 augmented reality mobile application. So without further ado, let's jump into the actual project and see what we can do with it. All right, so we are assuming that you already have downloaded Unity 6 and you have gone through the setup process. And today, what we are going to do is concentrate on the AR mobile template. So when you launch your Unity Hub, click on new project. And once you come to this particular screen from here, select AR mobile core template. If you did not download it yet, you're going to have an icon such as this. Click on that. It'll download it for you and you will be ready to go. So let's go ahead and name our project, Unity AR YouTube. And in this particular case, we don't want to connect to any of the uh, backend cloud services. You can go ahead and disable all of these things. You may or may not be associated with an organization. None of these things really matter at this particular time. Later on, if you do want to enable them, you can do so at your uh, within the project settings. So let's go ahead and click on pro Create Project, and this will take some time, and we'll come back after a coffee break. Okay, once Unity finishes up initializing and setting up the actual project, this is pretty much what you're going to see. You're gonna get a nice welcome menu over here that's going to give you a walkthrough and a start guide if you're interested in reading that. So let's go ahead and close this. And again, from the tutorials perspective, if you wanna get much more information on them, you can click on the quick start guide, the online documentation, forums, bug reports, template feedbacks, and et cetera. So there's all of these things available for you to check it out. Let's switch over to the inspector window. And all right guys, so one of the things I like to do is actually change the resolution. Uh, so if you click on this drop down menu, you would get a, uh, uh, drop down menu that will give you all of the available resolutions. And if a mobile resolution is not set, you can click on the plus icon and the plus icon will provide you with a menu where you can enter in a specific re resolution of your choice. In my case, I already have defined a mobile resolution of 1080 by 1920 that pretty much satisfy, satisfies both Android and iOS devices and it will change your game window output to something similar to this. So let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the hierarchy and see what we have. So we have a component for the AR session. This is uh, important. This will actually be the primary component that will handle all of your uh, AR sessions uh, about. We have our UI component where uh, initially it's going to give you some guidance as far as how to get started, what to do once you actually deploy the application onto the phone. And then we also have our XR origin, which is already rigged and it has a bunch of components on it in regard of uh, being able to detect where the XR origin is and uh, the default template also has an object spawner which in correlation with the ui is going to help you instantiate those objects so let's go ahead and click on play and see what the out of the box template provides you all right so one of the really cool things with this ar template is that we actually have some virtual walls and floors and as you move around the camera this cool feature detects those uh, vertical and horizontal planes and it'll allow you to basically go ahead and place objects onto the planes and once you move them or you can scale them as such so it's 
as easy as that, guys. It really is super easy. Uh, this particular episode is going to be short. I just wanted to let you guys know how easy and quick it is to deploy such an application. In our next episode, what we will be doing is doing a custom AR project. And in that particular episode, we'll get into the details of how to construct a really cool experience. All right. See you guys soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a good one. All right, guys, so this was a quick episode. The whole purpose of this episode was for you guys to see how easily and quickly you can actually create an augmented reality application now in Unity 6. And out of the book, some of the really cool stuff that's been already provided for you. In our next episode, we are going to work together to create a custom AR experience. And in that episode, we'll get into the details. All right, don't forget to like and subscribe and see you guys soon. Have a good one. Bye-bye.